Hi, good afternoon. Father Pip here. I'm not in my vicarage garden or in the church. I'm in a field in Dorset and it's very beautiful here. Lovely sunny evening. And I came here on a bicycle with a friend, as we're now allowed to do with a bit of social distancing. And today we're thinking about Pentecost because this Sunday just gone uh, was Pentecost Sunday. And on at Pentecost, we remember how God sent his Holy Spirit to help people know that Jesus was still with them in spirit and to help everybody know that they were God's children. So they all gathered in Jerusalem. I've got a map here, which could be the whole world. It's actually a map of part of Dorset, but it'll be the whole world for us. And people came just like these jelly babies um, from different parts of the world. So we had somebody here who came from France. And he could only speak French, so he said bonjour, which means hello in French. And uh, so there he was. We had somebody came from uh, Italy, and uh, she could only speak Italian. And she said ciao, which means hello in, it in Italian. But they couldn't understand each other. We had somebody from Spain, and he could only speak Spanish. And he said buenos dias, which means hello in Spanish. But they couldn't understand each other. Somebody from Russia came. Privyet, she said, which means hello in Russian, but they couldn't understand each other. And somebody from China came. Ni hao, he said, which means hello in Chinese, but they couldn't understand each other. They were all a bit suspicious of each other. But then the Holy Spirit came, and suddenly they were able to understand each other. And they were saying, ni hao, privyet, ciao, buenos dias, bonjour. And they could all be friends together. And they realized that although they were different colors, they were and different nationalities and different languages. They were all brothers and sisters, and Jesus was their friend, all of them. And so today, we might speak different languages. We have several different languages in our school, of course, and that's great, but we might speak different languages, but ultimately, we all speak the same language because we speak the same language of love and of forgiveness and of kindness and of understanding. So we celebrate Pentecost and give thanks for God's Holy Spirit that makes us all his children. No matter where we come from, no matter who we are, we can all understand each other because we speak the same language of love. So may God bless you and this new half term and very special new beginning really for many of you. Very strange and maybe kind of different sort of way of experiencing school, those of you who are there and those of you who are home and still trying to um, learn and be with us all together in the way that you are well done and um, may you all know that we're all one because we're all being given God's Holy Spirit we can all speak the same language of love and understanding and we're all God's children God bless you